fish takes us right into the sea. And he's backing down on the fish and the water's coming in the cockpit and everything. I mean, it's insane. The kids get a little bit nervous and run inside. And Gina, she's sitting there with the door open and has got the camera on and getting the whole thing, the whole thing on footage. So. Dude. The guy's sitting on our spot. Away. I'm coming! Ah! Woo -hoo -hoo! Ah! Wait up! Rob, 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 check it out. There he is, right there. Hey, Dude, what are you gonna do? Like I said, the coal front came flying through and the tarpon shut right down. We got a whole bunch of sailfish though. They turned on as soon as it got real cold. We was blowing out that one day, it was about 40. We got out the last couple days and we got some good numbers. We went two for six yesterday on the small boat. We went two for two the day before that on the big boat. Sailfish and turned on. I told you. We had six live baits in the spread. And I don't know how many sailfish were there, but we got three to hit at one time. So we had a triple going on. Got it. Yeah, dude, that, I had like 500 yards on that thing. Yeah. It looks like. Yeah, this was no run-of-the-mill sailfish. I mean, as soon as we saw this thing jump, you know, we knew it was a bigger sail. You know, we only get a few big ones like that every season. When the fish got next to the boat, and uh, we were able to see how big the fish was and uh, realized we had a good hook in it and we were going to be able to get a good leader on it, and we were stoked. It's real simple this time of year. We're getting tarpon and we're getting sailfish. If you want to catch big fish, you fish with Captain Jeff. That's right. And if you're out there stealing spots, get some help. Lunkerdog.com